Good morning guys and welcome to another video. When was the last time I do a video or at least start a video? Out in the yard. As you can see, we're here in Jamaica under the Jubilee mango tree. Take a look. It's coming on. There's a few. So pretty excited about that. You guys know I love Julie Man. So today I just wanted to do a little vlog. I didn't go on any kind of crazy adventure or any kind of outing recently. But I just wanted to do a little vlog of the day today because I have a few things to get done. As you can see, I kind of need a haircut. I hope I can get one done today. And I also have to go to the dentist. But before that, I don't show how I will be able to eat anything after the dentist. So there we go. And I'm pretty excited about the food today. We have... Jesus Christ. We have stewed chicken, of course rice, and dal. Vani make the dal, she is a good dal maker or dalist. So I'm pretty excited to do that, so let's go ahead. There it is guys. It took a bath. Heading on the road now. The dentist would not be ready for me for some time so i'm gonna go around and get some other things done that i, I have been putting off for some time for one i need to go in the bank ncb card machine in the atm ate my card over a month well over a month ago but i've been surviving you know with online banking i was able to take your vana card transfer stuff to the, and use but it's time i go and get back my atm card so let's do that Just came back from the bank, got my new bank card, so I'm good to go. Let me see, what do I do? Go to the dentist or get a haircut first? We'll see. Check it out. It looks pretty good. It was combed really nice and I kind of went and messed it up. It was very nice. But this is the best haircut I've ever gotten in Jamaica by a Jamaican barber. This guy, I'll come back by him all the time now. He knows how to cut. You know this type of hair. So I'm very, very happy it worked out for me today. <laughs> How does it look? How does it look? Tell me. Tell me in the comments. Just came back from the dentist's office. I do need to extract one of my wisdom teeth, but they want to put me on some antibiotics first, so I can't do it today. I'm kind of glad. It's just the antibiotics, you know, no dairy. What can I do? Fontana, as you can see, I have to go and get some medication. Medication, I realized that this vlog ended up being me just talking to you guys in the car. It was uh, much less interesting than I thought. Sorry if this vlog was a little uh, boring, but I wanted to mention something. I saw a TikTok where this guy, I'm not even going to show him or show his name, I don't want to give him any kind of exposure, but he's talking about how the US. And this is true, the US has issued a travel warning for Jamaica. The police can't handle the crime in Jamaica, you have to be careful and advising their citizens from traveling to Jamaica. And you know, this guy made this TikTok and it's getting some traction. And then he says something about, you know, you could go to the Grand Caymans. Not against the Grand Caymans, great place. But this perception that is constantly pushed about Jamaica, about it being a crime ridden place, is so far from reality. And I hope people watching my videos could see that Jamaica like any other country has its problems and yes it does have a crime problem Trinidad has a crime problem believe me the US has a crime problem and you guys know all the different stuff that happens randomly in the US that you have to be careful over there also I've been in Jamaica all these years and I actually feel very safe because I know where not to go I know who not to mix with just like any other country anywhere you're visiting in the world don't go places and don't mix with certain people yes random stuff happens now and then we can't do anything about that but this narrative that Jamaica is this crime ridden place and, and you have to be so careful when you come here not true if you guys want to come here for vacation go ahead book your flight you'll enjoy it you'll have a great guys, time so it's the next day and let me go in the light you guys can see that it's so funny that i started the vlog under the mango tree and this mango tree well in particular a mango caused this 
So every morning when I wake up, when mango is in season, and as you can tell, it is in season, I come and I look on the ground to see if there is any mango. I did that this morning, got all excited when I saw a nice big one right there, ran to pick it up and bend down, and there is a piece of metal here that sticks on the wall, I hit me right above the eye. Ah, it was painful, but you know, it led to more inconvenient things like having to go to the hospital. I got about four stitches, and this is just to keep it pressure on it here. So I'm fine. It didn't hit my eye itself, just right above it. And at least for two days, I have to have this big thing on my face. I can laugh about it now, but caused by a mango. Or the Caribbean, right? All right, guys. So all because of a mango, I now have to go back down to Fontana to get medication like a cream and stuff to clean out the cut and that kind of thing. In this battle of man versus mango, the mango clearly won. I also have to try and get the car clean. The car is really dirty now. I have one or two trips coming up that, you know, you have to present the car nice and clean to people. So I'll try to get that done today. Here by the road here, Mega Mart is right up the road. So we're in Catherine Hall and uh, my my friend here, Randy, he washes the car. He always does such a good job. It just takes a long time. But I'm willing to wait because excellent, excellent service. So yeah, get in the car washed. All right, so the car is being washed. There and across the road, we're seeing some cows. Yeah. I'm gonna take a closer look. Ooh, look at the size of him. Oops, he's kind of watching me. I'm backing off. Yeah, he's kind of watching me hard. Yeah, he doesn't look too happy. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna step out. Check it out. How clean the car looks. What well, is it? Something that when a car wash, it feels like it works better. So it's very clean inside and out. I'm very happy about. And that. I was just thinking with that cow I went across that's a bull actually I now realize that t-shirt is very very bright but he looked at me somewhere man I got really scared and I just crossed the road back I didn't, didn't want to venture to get any more footage I already had us to admit a very embarrassing thing to the doctor to get my stitches and that kind of thing that you know I get about said because of a mango it would have been quite embarrassing to go back and say I get damaged because a cow or a bull rush me ah. yeah too much for one week man too much for one I hope you guys enjoy this video the cut is still there check it out Right there. Giovanna cleaned it for me and everything, so I kind of look at normal now. I know this wasn't kind of a big adventurous video, but just a little, you know, maybe a slice of life vlog. Let me know if you like this kind of video, so maybe I could do more of this for you guys, if you want. All right, remember I now do tours. Anybody contact me if they want to do a tour when they visit Jamaica. As always, thanks for watching. Remember to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.